Hi everyone, here is another of my projects. I am sprouting seeds. I have alfalfa seed here, and after a week in my sprouter, this is what it looks like. This is gonna be going in the fridge as I will eat it. It takes about a week to get that far, and here is, here is what, after I rinsed it off, it is going in my fridge and I nibble on it and I put it in salads and I put it on tacos. And so that is what alfalfa looks like as sprouts. And then I did mung bean. Now I think I put too much mung bean in here and I'm gonna divide it up. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it in a jar. You don't need a fancy sprouter to do this you can use a jar with some um, cheesecloth on top, rubber band the top, and uh, grow it that way. So it doesn't have to cost you anything except maybe some seed, which you can get online. Soak the seed overnight, then every day you put water through it. If it's in the jar, you just put water on the top and in it, and then you drain it. Uh, you don't want it soaking, you don't want it just completely in water. Every night and every morning you do that and it, the water will drain out and you will have sprouts for next to nothing if you just can find some seeds. These came from the sprout house. Ooh, let's see. Um, they are under new ownership, and I think they were changing their website, but uh, that's a lot of seed. It's going to last a long time, so there you go. I'm trying to think if there's something else I should tell you about sprouting. You don't want to put tons of it, but uh, I never did mung beans before, so I did do too much, and they still have some growing to do. So I'm going to put them in the jar and see what happens. Couldn't hurt. Until next time, that's what I have here from Sunny Book Farm.